I'm David Freiberger from Hot Rod Magazine, and this is day five of Hot Rod Power Tour 2014. We're making our way from Norwalk, Ohio, all the way to Crown Point, Indiana. And today I'm going to bring you inside what it's like to deal with the photo shoots along the road with myself and legendary photographer Wes Allison. Wes and I have been doing this together on the Road with Power Tour for about 12 years straight. We kind of have a routine about how we get things done both on the highway and at the side of the road, and so we're going to show you what that's like. There's really three different ways that we shoot cars out on the road, one of which is we'll stop in these little small towns and we'll shoot cars in sort of pan blur action and stacks up of big lineups as they're going by. Now the other thing that we'll do is drive in the Chevrolet Performance Suburban that they loan us and we'll pull cars over to the side of the road and shoot groups of them in front of neat locations, old buildings, things like that. We'll also do what's called car-to-car -car photography. And this is the funniest thing, because Wes will hang out the window of the car and he's shooting at like a 15th of a second in order to get the background really blurry, but you need the car that you're shooting to stick right at the exact same speed as the Suburban that I'm driving. And getting people to do that can be frustrating. <laughs> Okay, guide to Wes Allison hand signals while your car is being photographed on the road. Of course, there's the natural coming this way and going that way, but then there's also the get your elbow in the car, elbow in. You'll see him doing that one. Then there's also paper off the dash, paper off the dash, and the classic uh, vent window, close, vent window, close. People will wave and he'll just be, no, no wave, no wave. It's funny, all of this stuff, it really irritates him. Here's the other thing we do is find neat locations at the side of the road to shoot car features. A minute ago it was nice and overcast, great photo here up against this old building. And uh, the 65 GTO, pretty amazing. All right, that took a little bit of work, but I think we got the shot. You never know when that might be a cover of Hot Rod, but at the very least, it'll be a full page inside the magazine. Carbon monoxide poisoning. Carbon monoxide poisoning. The only reason he keeps coming back. <laughs> 